Previously on Zakia Loves Pinto. I love that death is looked at as this beautiful part of life. You know, food. Tequila. convinced me to go around in this dang circle and participate y'all may not know this about me but i'm very shy i'm very shy and this made me feel extremely uncomfortable but i'm kind of weird because i like to push myself to do uncomfortable things even though it makes me feel just wacky but she made me go out there hey, uh, he, uh, hey, uh, hey, uh. You thought I wasn't about to hand sanitize the crap out of my hands? I touched hands with people I did not know. Like, really didn't know. Okay, no. I got the hand sanitizer out right away, okay? <laughs> Coming and offering an embrace is like embracing your loved ones who are no longer here with us. I think this is so sweet. It's a lady on um, the stage who lost some of her loved ones and recently lost her daughter. You go up and give this beautiful woman a hug and you hug her to encourage her because she's lost someone and give her support. and. It's also like you're hugging the people that you've lost, which I thought was like, mm -hmm. where are you doing that? It's so cool. What are you, you thinking know? about? Huh? What are you thinking about? I was thinking about my grandmother. Mm -hmm. Thinking about my uncle Larry. You know, a lot of uh, people that I've lost in my life that were very meaningful to me. Who are you yeah. thinking about? I definitely think about my grandma. Yeah. Um, and yeah, my godparents, all of them. They're really important to you. Huh? Oh, absolutely. Yep. Yeah. And my auntie, man. I'm hugging my grandmother. So it was just such a sweet gesture to do, and I felt um, like her energy was really beautiful. Yeah. And she was really, she was really open sweet. to receiving all the love that she was receiving from everyone. And, uh, it's kind of rare, so. I was definitely in a moment too because I don't know if that would be something I would normally like do. But I mean, we were here the day of the dead and where they actually celebrate that person's life. And it actually just felt like it was the right thing to do, you know? So. For sure. <laughs> you're going to get any flowers. I'm going to have to just pick some up off the ground and sprinkle it on me. <laughs> What's so cool about going to like different cultural festivals is that you get to not just see the culture, but you get to taste the culture and be a part of it. So I thought it was pretty cool that we got to have a chance to actually taste a little bit of what they have offering. So I'm excited. This is tapache, so we have um, tamarind citrus, pineapple spice, orange juice. This one's not spicy, the spice is actually cinnamon, so this doesn't have a spice to it. Of course, visit our website, overallvents.com, and you can get more information. Be careful, Thank you so much. I love these, I haven't had these in years. Cheers. Cheers. Okay, you ain't buy it first. Hold on. Chocolato. Chocolate. So we pull up and they actually have concha. And so if you don't know what concha is, it is a sweet bread roll. And the top layer of the bread is actually kind of like this crispy, sweet, flaky thing on top of it. Anyways, <clears throat> to be honest, their bread was all right but I grew up on this, you know, so I know that culture is actually really delicious, especially when it's fresh. 
and it's homemade. This one kind of tastes like it was sitting out all day, but it was cool because once I dipped it in the chocolate milk, it was actually pretty good. So it's hot. It's rich. It's real hot. <laughs> it's real hot. I can't even <laughs> taste it yet. Oh no, wait. I hate. Listen, I hate burning my tongues or burning my taste buds. Especially when they're like, it'd be burnt for days, okay? When I go to Starbucks, I get the kids tip. That should tell you a lot about me. Not very, very sweet. Cinnamony. It's cinnamony. Right. It's not very sweet at all. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers. Let me call you right. I'm gonna dip mine. Mmm. Let's see. That looks good. I, I can take you to uh, a place where you get some. Yeah? That looks good. She making me try this. It's soap. Okay. Ooh. Oh. Ooh. Now we're Let's see if it really soap up. Oh wow! I'm out here clean. I mean clean. I mean clean. Hands clean. Face clean. Clean. Everything. Oh, everything. Everything. I'm gonna try to mess it up. I got Okay, I'm rinsing. Oh my gosh. See, that's why I said. We could not, we can just <laughs> use uh, my water. I'm satisfied. Are you? But your hands clean though. They actually are clean. It's kind of drying though, a little bit. Like they feel a little dry. Well, that's what happens when it's clean. What kind of soap is that? Don't blame the soap. This okay, some bleach. Just your crassy ass, cracky ass. <laughs> He's spending money. Bye, bye. Did you vote for Lamar? Lamar was black. He got my vote. I feel like the bag lady right now. Look how tall I am. No, look, my shoulder is up at your shoulder. Yeah, that just means you got long legs, but you got a short torso. I like the concha. It but was. just like you in, in my mind, you like dry. 